Uh, I think we're all slowly dying. Just he needs a tree right now to be able to it kill. It smells so bad. I know it's basically it's a, dead it's a, skin. It's a pungent. It's a pungent. It's rolled bone. up dead skin. I you think. know they have more than one at the store. You can choose. I think it's the Courtney's blaming her smell on the pungent bone. I oh, have that's it. Right. That, that probably is how, how Courtney smells. Mm -hmm. Hi Courtney. Hi guys. Uh, <laughs> oh, are we going? We're going. Oh uh, no, guys. Welcome, oh. welcome to uh, the pungent bone. Oh my God, guys. <laughs> the worst. <laughs> Bar in Hollywood. <laughs> the worst bar, the pungent bone. Yeah, that sounds really cool. Bone. I like to think that it's a very refined bar. It's like, hi, welcome to the pungent bone. <laughs> <They're always> like, <laughs> dry heaving from the smell. Like, uh, uh. Django's back and three times the size he was last time and much more awake. He's, he's definitely so... he's definitely getting big. Uh, and we also have Damien here. Oh, what's up? Smosh <laughs> Games. I'm also three times the size and much more awake. I don't think I've been on a show with no name since like I first hung out with Smosh. Like the first like time before you just, were like an was, employee here. Or? Yeah, well, you guys just you had me on, you know, when I was just starting out. Now a lot of you guys know Damien really well. Uh, he and I have a show on Smosh Games. Uh, he's been on our channel a few times, but uh, and he's my best friend. It's true. Sure, Shane's been uh, replaced, just like most of my joints. Damien, we have a quick <laughs> "Would you rather" question for you, okay. just so fans can get to know you a little better. Would you rather only be able to listen to Kenny Loggins' "I'm All Right" when playing music, or only be able to watch Devil Man Cry Baby? when watching TV. I don't even have to think about that. I'm going with Kenny Loggins' I'm All Right. It's a great song. Uh, <laughs> Kenny Loggins is the only live concert I've ever been to. What song is that? I'm, I'm All Right. No matter what about, about me. me. And it's a very positive <laughs> song. Whereas Devil Man Cry Baby uh, makes me question uh, why I exist and it's makes me show. not happy. Game of Thrones is coming back at some point. I'm not gonna just keep watching Devil Man Cry Baby yeah. while everyone's <laughs> like, Turns out Sansa's a bird. I can't believe it's such a twist. Yeah, yeah, because yeah, it's not like people are like, oh, do you hear that music? I wonder what the next music's gonna be. Yeah, like it, yeah. TV also, shows, you can be part of conversation. I hate music, honestly. Once they like, once like Beef Oven, I think it was, came and went. Beef oven, like yeah. we peaked. Yeah, I loved Beef Oven. Be be beef, beef Oven beef was oven. so good. Be oh. Yeah, like it's German. My special art. Okay, oh. our time. Oh, oh. Oh, yes. Oh, I saw that before. Oh, oh I love. I responded to this at on Twitter. I own a munch. Drew us as My Hero Academia characters. One of my favorite shows. Mm -hmm. One of your favorite shows. Mm -hmm. Great anime. I am Bakugo, which is awesome because I stream Howitzer really Impact all the time. Uh, Shane is All Might, of course, the yes. Captain Falcon of the show. Courtney is Uraraka. It's a good character. Okay, you like okay. that. Um, also, main female love interest. Ooh. Ooh. Wait, are we little love interest? Mm. No, it's no, unfortunately, I'm sorry. Oh, that's fine. Sorry to disappoint that's you. That's okay. Oh my God, Keith is Mineta. So he's a, basically a tiny little pervert diaper man that's always like, <laughs> oh, that girl has boobs, I, I, I will say Olivia as, um, as a Sue. Sweet, Sue. Uh, Sue is the most accurate. Oh. Olivia is that character. That character's so weird. Well, okay. that is great. What a art. I love I'm it. Freaking awesome. Can I see some more art? Uh, no. Next topic. Um, <laughs> do I do I just swipe it up? Oh no no the my swatch art just falls down. Oh. Art is falling in oh. the sky. Oh, oh the my loom. god! The loom. Loom. Oh, I love oh no no! The humanity. I love beef oven. There it goes. I love beef oven and you're breaking the set. Art. Your art. 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 Uh, no. Um, Allison at Mutated Flower. If the Smosh Squad was on the reality TV show Survivor, who would be the first one to get voted off the island and why? So, um, <laughs> first to get voted off. Mari's been on Survivor. See, she that's did well. The thing. She has experience. She has experience, but she could also kick all her butts at it. It's true. Would you bring Django if you were on Survivor? That's Why, another mouth to feed. Him? No, that's another mouth to feed. I wouldn't eat Django. My God, I love Django. Because I, I was gonna say I would bring him as an extra meal just in case. You never know when you're in the wild Absolute what psycho. you're gonna have to oh, eat. Oh God. First place I'd probably vote off would be myself. Because you want to really go home. be on a stranded island. I'd rather go home and be with my puppy. <gasps> All right, uh, great. Courtney's gets voted off. Bye, Courtney. Bye, Courtney. Allison at Mutated Flower. That's the one. Asks, if the Smosh Squad was on a uh, oh. That's the one. <laughs> Damien Haas, my heart, at XX Sassmaster XX, asks, what inanimate object would be the most annoying? 
or most interesting if it could talk while being used? Definitely toilet. <laughs> Cause oh, it's like, please oh, feed oh. me poop. <laughs> <laughs> I, used to, I used to think like that as a kid. I used to think the toilet needed to be fed. Feeding time. Ew. <laughs> Maybe like soap. Oh yeah. yeah like, like, oh yeah, get over there. Get over, get over oh, here. Get over there. You're gonna go wanna get that there, mold check. Down, go back down, <laughs> <laughs> Also microwave, cause it would then just be a word that's like, just like keep on to that monotone. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Light bulbs, you just turn them on and it was like, Woo! <laughs> <laughs> and then screaming they, the whole time. When, they, when you dim them, it's like, Woo! Oh. You can harmonize them though, and then that's beautiful. He's so confused. This one comes from Xenthosus at Zachary Newbie. Hashtag Ask Smosh, what is your most memorable interaction with a fan? Ooh. I got kidnapped for two days and held in a basement. And though I try, I don't, I can't forget it. This is back in like 2012. Mm -hmm. I was at the gym, like late at night, I was at like 10 p.m. And this guy, this like 30 something year old guy walks up. He was just like, hey, are you Shane from So Random? And I was like, I was like, uh, yeah. He's like, I love that show. And I was just like, That's oh, great. cool, man. <laughs> like, just this fully grown man just like, I love that Disney show. Great. That's amazing. And it was so like casual. It wasn't like weird yeah. or anything. It was just like, yeah, it's a great show. I'd like to think we transcended Aww. demographics for that show. Yeah. Everybody loved it. For Smosh fans though, VidCon, like, yeah. there, there are some people who are like just so excited to see us. We do this so much that you forget how much it means to some people and how much we're connecting with people. If I may real quick, I have a real answer other than uh, being trapped in the basement. I was uh, showing around my childhood best friend a couple weeks ago who came out to visit. Um, I hadn't seen him in like seven or eight years. Uh, and so we were just sitting at a ramen bar. I never really get recognized. I'm like pretty nondescript. But if I'm like with Shane or Courtney, yeah, it happens. But I was just me and my friend. And so as we were leaving, um, a fan named, I think Rebecca, hi Rebecca, um, just asked for a photo and, you know, to say hi. And it was just really cool, like, you know, my friend always knew I wanted to be an actor and do stuff like that. And then he gets to oh, see like the one that. time I get recognized is yeah. like, wow, that was super cool. I think one really memorable time was last year, Vomicon. <laughs> I love Vomicon. Welcome to Vomicon. <laughs> Welcome to Vomicon. <laughs> Oh, I'm getting some. It was last day of VidCon, like Sunday, so a lot of people have already gone home, and there was a small group of fans that like I engage with a lot on Twitter and stuff. I thought I was gonna have to leave, and then like as we were leaving, we were out front of the the whole convention center, and they were all there, and like I just got to like hang out with them and talk to them, and like one of them like hugged me and was just Aww. like crying. And That's really sweet. I just love just like standing and talking. They're just <laughs> a pure happiness where like they're 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 happy because they're talking to me, and I'm just happy because I've made all these people happy. So it's just like a happy that feels time. Really good. I will say this, there is nobody who's more excited about meeting fans and stuff than Courtney. You've always been so stoked on like events or meetups and everything. Like That's you, really cool. You are probably just as excited as the fans are. I just love the community. I'm genuinely stoked too, Shane. Are yeah. you the only one who's not? <laughs> do me, do me. No! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, you guys asked for this. Mm. It's time for another roast, but this time we're gonna roast you. I get to be part of a roast? Uh, so we asked you guys to send us a pic of yourself uh, with hashtag Smosh Roast Me. This one comes to us from at Mothman underscore is underscore gay. Uh, <laughs> they say, uh, roast me, go on, roast me, probably your only fan over 18. Also, Keith Lee Jr., I can drive unlike you, you scrub. Uh, <laughs> Whoa! This is brutal! So, Mothman, uh, just looking at you right here, all the looks and styles in the world, and you're going with Shane? Really? <laughs> that's that's yeah. what you think? <laughs> that's good. Bummer, buddy. It's good to know that someone's keeping 2007 alive. Yeah! yeah. So, is it we well? signed the, the, Except the for me. Wayfarers. It's great. I'm not good at this. Just make fun of that person. You're, you're dumb. Your eyebrows are good. Oh, crap. She captured the Falcon X launch in the background of his photo. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, oh my nice God. rocket launch, stupid. Nice freaking, what are you, a science geek? Blech. Oh, that's the only thing going places in this picture. Oh! Oh! I set that up, I set that up. That's so, nice, right. that's nice. So this is Ember, at Ember Star, and I think 
the only star in this picture is the galaxy print on your dress. Oh! Mm -hmm. See, I don't know why she needs an umbrella when we're throwing all this shade her way. Oh! oh. No, no. Yeah. <laughs> she is emo pumpkin spice latte. Emo pumpkin spice latte. I like latte. it. Fish nets on your uh -huh. legs. What are you trying to catch? Leg fish? <laughs> How many tumblers do you think Ember owns? Depends. <laughs> she probably has like four fandoms for Tim Burton alone. Mm -hmm. Between all their titles, how many uh, underscores do you think are in there? Seven. Ivan Gonzalez at Ivo Gonzalez has given us a photo of him in his favorite shirt. What's the shirt say? The need. The need for speed. Looks like you could use some speed because those circles under your eyes, clearly you haven't been getting much sleep. That was so mean. I like, Ivan, that um, all your facial hair has moved to the coastline, <laughs> where, it's, where it's much nicer. <laughs> and just like America, the middle, the middle parts aren't, aren't as quite as populated, so that's, that's real nice. Um, Ivan reminds me of a lot of my friends that I had growing up, of someone who, who's, who definitely owns a kendo sword, and, and if you're over at his house, we'll be like, here, let me show you some tricks. <laughs> Is that just me? That's also, that's just uh, us. That's just us. What's in the background? Uh, that's what I was actually gonna comment on. There's not a whole lot under those stairs there. Uh, you have no feng shui. Ooh, it's spelled feng shui, look it up. Hey! At Karn W underscore. Underscore. Oh God. Oh God, this is good. Hello, this is Mrs. Great. Minion. One, the, oh God, that was okay. <laughs> well, Minion. That was the one I had. I like that you took this in a Forever 21, uh, Karen. Uh, but uh. you've already got your outfit all picked out. Again, as Courtney said, it's Minion. Now, Karen, I've never heard you speak, but I have a feeling, based on the way you look, that this is how you talk. Hey, what's going on, you guys? <laughs> <laughs> I think she looks like she sounds like, Hey, everybody, isn't that? I'm Here's the Karen. Karen, how you doing? I'm bu bu see trees and bees. <laughs> this one comes to us from at JT Little Wad. Um, nice protective glasses, JT. Do they protect you from pretty girls? Yeah, you're supposed to uh, put the uh, 3D glasses in the bin after the movie. This Ready Player One poster looks really good. <laughs> that's that's good. really good. That's really good. That's why you're here. See? Oh, God. Is that tape or are those? Is that what are those? I think they light up or something. Oh, <laughs> those are bumpers in case Boop. people get too close. <laughs> <laughs> you honestly look a little like me as a teenager. <laughs> Every roast is a roast on you. Yeah. Do you think he cuts his hair perfectly so that it ends right at the glasses? His mom does. <laughs> <laughs> I love his face in this because he took this picture just being like, all right, here it comes. <laughs> <laughs> to everybody that we roasted, we actually like you. And we I know really we said the like word stupid yeah. a lot. You're not stupid. Thanks you're for being brave enough great. to be That's roasted. That's the word that bullies use as a defense mechanism when they can't think of anything else clever. Bullies always called me a very silly man. This has been great. How did I do? You guys are great. You did good. Some of these fans are going to message you, though, because you were a little harsh. You were actually the meanest one. You were very mean. I was. You called every one very of them mean. stupid. Uh -huh. It yeah. looks like it was me, but and it, there was like vitriol in your eyes, too. You were like, they're mm. stupid. Well, we have roasted you. Now you know what it feels like when you roast me mm -hmm. and Keith and Noah. And um, uh, I don't think I've been roasted yet, so turn about is fair play. Pretty yeah, much they throw pretty some much stuff my way. And I can take it. Get me. Are you sure? You sure you want to open that door? Because, man, they're relentless. They're going to say stuff like nice blonde hair, stupid. No, they're they'll be like nice uneven spine. They make fun of scoliosis? That's rude. I mean, they definitely made fun of Noah's posture, nice, I feel Nice like. person, idiot. Um, nice idiot, stupid butt. She yeah. roast me. No. Tweet. No. You smell like khaki. <laughs> <laughs> anyways, anyways, guys, we'll see you later. Yeah, love bye. You. Hit the bell, follow Thank us, you. go get us. We love you, bye. Yeah, just get us. Thanks for watching. Check back next week for more. In the meantime, click on the box things to watch other fun stuff.